He who commits injustice is ever made more wretched than he who suffers it. Was not this what we spoke of as the great advantage of wisdom, to know what is known and what is unknown to us? If a man can be properly said to love something, it must be clear that he feels affection for it as a whole and does not love part of it to the exclusion of the rest. Many men are loved by their enemies and hated by their friends and are the friends of their enemies and the enemies of their friends. The more the pleasures of the body fade away, the greater to me is the pleasure and charm of conversation. Music is a moral law. It gives soul to the universe, wings to the mind, flight to the imagination, and charm and gaiety to life and to everything. The first and greatest victory is to conquer yourself. To be conquered by yourself is of all things most shameful and vile. Wise men speak because they have something to say, fools because they have to say something. We can easily forgive a child who is afraid of the dark. The real tragedy of life is when men are afraid of the light. Human behavior flows from three main sources, desire, emotion, and knowledge. One of the penalties for refusing to participate in politics is that you end up being governed by your inferiors. A good decision is based on knowledge and not on numbers. You can discover more about a person in an hour of play than in a year of conversation. Good people do not need laws to tell them to act responsibly, while bad people will find a way around the laws. We are twice armed if we fight with faith. Be kind, for everyone you meet is fighting a harder battle. Every heart sings a song incomplete until another heart whispers back. Those who wish to sing always find a song. At the touch of a lover, everyone becomes a poet. Only the dead have seen the end of war. The price good men pay for indifference to public affairs is to be ruled by evil men. Do not train a child to learn by force or harshness, but direct them to it by what amuses their minds, so that you may be better able to discover with accuracy the peculiar bent of the genius of each. There are two things a person should never be angry at, what they can help and what they cannot. I am the wisest man alive, for I know one thing, and that is that I know nothing. The beginning is the most important part of the work. Love is a serious mental disease. Death is not the worst that can happen to men. Never discourage anyone who continually makes progress, no matter how slow. Desires are not the lack of something, and those who have the greatest desires are in a worse condition than those who have none or very slight ones. If women are expected to do the same work as men, we must teach them the same things. Ignorance, the root and the stem of every evil. Laws are partly formed for the sake of good men in order to instruct them how they may live on friendly terms with one another and partly for the sake of those who refuse to be instructed, whose spirit cannot be subdued or softened or hindered from plunging into evil. Man is a tame or civilized animal, nevertheless, he requires proper instruction and a fortunate nature, and then of all animals he becomes the most divine and most civilized. But if he be insufficiently or ill-educated, he is the most savage of earthly creatures. No human thing is of serious importance. There is no such thing as a lover's oath. Thinking is the talking of the soul with itself. No evil can happen to a good man, either in life or after death. Poetry is nearer to vital truth than history. The direction in which education starts a man 
will determine his future life. Let every man remind their descendants that they also are soldiers who must not desert the ranks of their ancestors or from cowardice fall behind. <laughs>